Question 14. So we have white shapes and black shapes in a game, and they are circles and squares. We're told that the ratio of white shapes to black shapes is 3 to 7. And then there are white circles and white squares in the ratio of 4 to 5. And black circles and black squares in the ratio of 2 to 5. And we need to work out the fraction of all the shapes that are circles. So quite a complicated question to start to think about. Now, there's a couple of ways of doing it, but the way I found easiest to explain would be to use a tree diagram to show the information. And I'm going to switch to fractions because the question wants it as a fraction for the answer. So I know I've got white shapes and black shapes. Three tenths of the shapes are white. Seven tenths of the shapes are black. And that comes from this line here. The ratio of number of white circles to the number of white squares. So from the white shapes, I can have circles or squares. Four ninths of the white shapes are circles and five ninths are squares. For the black shape, there's also circles and squares. Two sevenths of the black shapes are circles, which means five sevenths are squares. So when it comes to work at what fraction of all the shapes are circles, there are two pathways to take. They are white circles. And there are black circles, so two pathways along the tree diagram. So to get a white circle, that would be three tenths times four ninths, which would be 12 over 90. Getting this sum picks me up my first mark. To get a black circle, I'd have to work out 7 tenths times 2 sevenths, which is 14 over 70. And there's my second mark. So I've worked out the proportion of these shapes that are white circles are 12 over 90, 12 ninetieths. And the fraction of these shapes that are black circles are 14 seventieths. Work out what fraction of all the shapes are circles. I simply have to add these together. So 12 over 90 plus 14 over 70. Just going to see how these simplify to see um, to make the addition easier. So 12 over 90. Uh, if I divide by 6 becomes 2 over 15, 14 over 70, and divide it by 2, becomes 7 over 35, oh, I can divide it by 7 now, becomes a fifth. So 1 fifth of all the shapes are black circles and 2 fifteenths are white circles. Showing the examiner that you know you've got to add 1 fifth to 2 fifteenths or any of the equivalent fractions here. We'll pick you up your third mark and being able to add them is the final mark. So I need to make the denominator the same. I'm going to choose 15. So that's 3 fifteenths because that's 3 times as big. I'm sorry, the 1 and the 5 have been times by 3 plus 2 fifteenths. So that's 5 over 15, which is a third. And I have my fourth mark, one in three of these shapes are circles.